everything's moved to cyberspace. Where we do business, where we shop, where we communicate, where we meet our friends. Everything's moved to cyberspace now. Everything's being digitized and moved there, where we educate and learn. In other words, everything's moved to a realm where we're all connected and no one's in charge. And so we're all now interacting in a realm with, with no values. I tell the story in my book of how YouTube was running Miller beer ads on ISIS videos until somebody pointed that out to them. And of course, YouTube and Google weren't saying, let's run beer ads on ISIS videos. The algorithm was just doing it. This is a true story. This is actually a big story. So the question of what values reign in cyberspace really matters, but also for another reason. Individuals now. We now live in a world of this age of acceleration where individuals are now getting super empowered to both make things and break things. Oh, if you want to make something today, you were born at the right time. But if you want to break something today, you were also born at the right time. The same powers. So the more I thought about all of this, the more it struck me that we're now at a moral intersection we've actually never stood at before as a human species. In 1945, we entered a world where one country could kill all of us. And if it had to be one country, I'm glad it was ours. But I, I think we're entering a world where one person can kill all of us. And at the same time, where all of us could actually fix everything. These same powers enable us today, if we put our mind to it, to feed, house, and clothe, and educate every person on the planet.